talk about different plants that I'm, I'm growing here. This, believe it or not, is from a pot uh, sweet potato. Um, I had left it, I guess, too long and I started sprouting. I said, okay, I'm going to put it in a bag. And it grew long shoots. And I planted it. And this is what's happening. It's growing up. The vines tend to go up and I have to like put them in. They want to latch on to whatever they can uh, grow. And these are typically meant to grow along the ground. And that's how sweet potatoes, I believe, are done, are grown. But for now, I'm just experimenting and I just have it here. I don't know what's going to happen when the fall comes and it's colder and I bring my plants indoors. It's going to take a while for them to get acclimated to the weather. So I don't know if it's going to grow or what will happen, but I do need to water it. Does you see the soil down there? So, And I use these bamboo skewers from the Dollar Tree to skewer up my um, plants. And here, these on these pots right here are all potatoes. And we started this back in April. We purchased um, some potato uh, p uh, potatoes that had their actual uh, sprouts on them, and we planted them. And um, some of them are there's two types that we have here. This one here is a gem a gemson. Um, you know, it's luck with them depending this one uh, it was growing up so well early on and then all of a sudden it kind of died back um, I watered every every second day and then now I have to go through and pull out all the leaves that are dying here but um, and then here it has some type of like a fungus or some discoloration and I learned that if you want to prevent that for the next season's growth, you have to soak your potatoes in some type of solution. And we didn't do that. We just planted them. And planting is just basically um, an experiment. You want to see what's going to grow, how it's going to grow. This one too, this one's growing well. Again, but something, I don't know, is happening to them. They're drying up. And this one is a snow finger. So there's two varieties, Jemson and snow finger. That we have here and again I just clip them up because they like to sprawl out we don't have the room for it so and these bags if you noticed here these are collapsible bags they're cloth bags so you water them the water will pour out of them so it's a good drainage si system so that's what we have used um, now how to know when they're ready when the potatoes are have come up is they will have uh, flowers blooming on them and then the plant will start to die and that's how you know your potatoes in the soil are ready to be harvested so we're hoping um, late August early September this one has come along pretty well again it all depends on the Sun and you know how things are so here as well and uh, hard to control them. You bring them back, you come up the next day, they're growing and they're <laughs> growing over the balcony. But this is the situation, what it looks like. And these are all the types here. So we have how many bags? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bags. We had a tenth bag, but it died. And the reason was is that I had planted some um store-bought potatoes and I let it the eyes grow and then I would plant them and I found that they grow but they're not as strong as the ones that are bought from a company um, because in the stores they spray chemicals on the potato so that it won't sprout and some of them still fight it and they sprout so I had put well, not these ones here because that's yeah these ones here are hmm these, that's again that's snow finger and that's jemson and these were in a separate um, container or, or smaller containers and I just want to see if they would come up because we had extra potatoes and they did and because 
the bag was very small that's how they grew up pretty skinny and lanky like this so and over here are my green onions from the store and down here um, this is a pineapple and um, you can grow this in soil um, what you do is you um, you can grow it either you can soak it in water um, and have gr uh, roots grow or you could put it right to the soil and water it and it will start growing and this is from since I guess May and um, yeah it's growing and how you water this too see there's new shoots on the inside of this in here okay so what you do is um, yeah you water it from the inside you pour the water directly in there and that's how it's watered so and it's growing it's slow I mean it's gonna it'll grow pineapples I don't know long time from now a couple years more than that a couple years five to ten years but hey you know planting is an experiment right Thanks for watching Rebel Cam, and don't forget to hit that subscribe, share if you wish, and we will talk very soon with another video. Bye-bye.